this is the overall system block diagram for this project the channel considered is an AWGN channel and it's assumed that there is no receiver noise nor any interference and jamming the detection and the pre-processing is talked about first in this video the receiver detection and pre-processing subsystem is accomplished using a three element Yagi antenna USRP1 receiver and GNU radio companion the antenna is made of three aluminium rod elements attached to a wooden boom. Table 1 represents the antenna's physical characteristics. The frequency range of operation is between 117 and 137 MHz used for air traffic control. A center frequency of 127 MHz was chosen for design purposes. A maximum gain of 10.7 dBi was achieved. 70 and 25 degree half power beam widths were obtained for the horizontal and vertical planes respectively. The 4NEC2 software package was used to optimize and simulate the antenna's performance in terms of gain, half power beam width and the VSWR. The pre-processing is a simple process involving a Blackman window low pass filter. The filter has a 100 kHz pass band and a 20 kHz transitional band. This shows the results of the pre-processing. After the pre-processing, the data then goes through the classification algorithm. AMC can be split into two parts, one being into cumulants for future extraction, and the other into KNN, which is the classification algorithm used just to simulate the AMC, running a program at 10 dB SNR with 50 reference points and 2048 samples per signal. As you can see over here, this is how the QAM signal received looks like. And these are the cumulants. This point over here is the received signal, and these are the reference points. As you can see, the closest points here are the magenta points, which are the 64 QAM cumulants. There are various applications, military for example, civilian for cultural radios, and last but not least, 